This should be a real fun 45 minutes. It's a fast and furious 45 minutes. Terrence is going to produce today. So Terrence is going to leave us with, he's going to impart his piece of wisdom on branding for us before he goes off to produce more Emmy Award winning television. You have to remember, if you're going in to be up for a show, right, to host, to be on it, there's a million people coming in. Right, so I'm sitting at my desk all day, right, watch American Idol, you see a little piece of it. You 10 come in, you leave. Another 10 come in, you leave. Another 10 come in, you leave. So if 100 people come in all day long, what are the chances that you're gonna remember three of them? We put a picture of people, and we put the with a blank. If you know who you are, it's not enough to go and say, I wanna be the host of a TV show. It's I'm this guy, and this is why you need me to be here, because I'm the this. It's confidence, authenticity, and knowing your story. And don't fake a thing. As soon as you fake, audiences are smart enough now to know. They've been watching reality television too long now to know that fakes don't last. And reality TV is really method acting. When you look at method actors, what do they do? If, if he woke up and his arm was cramped, that's part of his character. Give me the details. Because when you walk out of that room, like Terrence said, they're going to put on the walls. The girl who made out with the janitor in her high school in the janitor's closet. Think about it. Get on the grill. Don't be scared. Share your story. Enjoy your story. No ands, no oohs, no uhs, because there's going to be surprises. At six years old, I knew I wanted to be a professional basketball player, and I did it. Feeling erotic massages in the nudes for men. Why do you sit with us? Okay, my name is Shanti, and I'm a mother of three. I'm a Pilates instructor. I grew up. And to the last 10 years of my life, I was in a religious cult. I told the world all about my nipple piercings and my plan to work on down with it. Uh, I don't know how other parts will stop. 22 years old, I'm in England, faced with three choices. Do I have accommodation? Do I come to America to film school? Or do I take a job playing Sherlock Holmes on the BBC? Oh, Turn down the BBC. Daddy got the job that made you proud.